Gravitational field is distorting. It's a reaction to warp out. Gambling reinforcements? No, it's not. It's a different pattern than usual. Boom! Our reinforcements! Huh? What is that? Gundams! There's another Earth font ship on Earth besides the Yamato that can warp? No, those Gundams, those mobile suits warped out here independently. What's going on, Setsuna? I don't know. This is just supposed to be a quantum jump experiment. I don't know how we got here. Is that the sun? And look what's happening here. They're fighting. That's a group, no, a civilization that we've never seen before. They're a different species? If that's the case... Ooh. What's wrong, Tobia? Not positive, but whoever's piloting Gundams doesn't seem to be hostile for us. That's the wrong sound effect for a new type flash. Extrasensory protection, huh? Are the pilots of those units new types? Commander Schultz! Those are Terran weapons! Attack! Yes, sir! They're firing at us! Can't believe this is how our first encounter with alien species is going. Is you from Gundam Double O? If only the quantum system was complete, then we'd at least be able to communicate. Don't give up, Terria. At least there are humans on the other side who are picking up my signal. Really? I'm calling out an open channel. It's all I can do. Commander, there's a ship message coming from those random type ships. It's an Earth Common. I want an explanation for what's going on. The pilots of those unknown Gundams speak Common? Commander, what's going on? It could be like what happened with the Gari and Surugi. Uh, Ihara, tell them we aren't hostile and ask them for help. Roger. Commander, apparently those units are from... The, 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 the message from those units was in Terran language. So it is Terran reinforcements. If they can warp out like this, then we've underestimated their technological progress. We've already mostly got you beat, so maybe not. Destroy them before they can get out with the Yamato. Fire! Those green ships are treating us as hostile. And those Gundams are Gundams with the others. They definitely are based off the same concept as mobile suits, but they are Gundams. Okay, I trust your instincts. Thanks, Terria. Let's side with the Gundams and get the heck out of here. The message was in common. There could be a special military force we don't know about. Commander, the Gundam types have signaled they'll, they'll help us. Good. We'll get out of this mess together. Setsuna! I know. We can't land it here. The true objective of Celestial Being must be accomplished. Yes, you are from Gundam Double O. Having discussion and investigating the truth about our world. That is our mission. Okay, so we got you here. You here. Then you two schmucks over here. So, the team has to get level these guys up to level 7, 7, 7, 7. Okay, like only like Tetsuya and Kincaid and Korthi Yamato are higher level. Now, here's the question Do you have the map of Micro Missile? Because this has ignore size. Which means this is perfect for shooting two capital ships. We'll kill them, but it softens them up and lets me move forward. Let's do all the action again. False laser on you. This again. Kill you, but it'll soften you up enough that someone else will. Like Tobia! Alright. 
Now we can just focus on moving forward. Can I use Analyze? You are softened up. barrier. The good news is I got guys who are immune to who can punch through but special special decks can punch through barriers. Alright. Has ignore size. This has barrier buster. Three commands. Alright, so you can hear if they hit me, so let's turn on design clicker so you can't. This is really encounter with the alien species, and I guess nothing I do will make much of a difference. But I have to keep moving forward. I have to continue my work as an innovator and my work for the quant. Not bad, and punch this barrier. Where did those come from? You've only got the one ship. I love because of this, I'm completely able to no sell this attack. Because so, like, I, I triggered that ability. Like, what? What you got? You got nothing. You got nothing. You threw all this beams and that and missiles at me, and you got nothing, and you like it. So you got a fast pack installed. Alright, no one else in the position to attack right now. I'm gonna use my buff ability, so. Oh no, I'm doing ones who haven't acted yet. Uh, who hasn't acted? Okay, you haven't acted. A barrier buster and ignore size. Okay, here this goes. Actually, let's, let's, leave, let's leave Demo on, because we haven't seen all of Chevalier. Because we didn't fight Le Chevalier last time, we expressly chose not to. <laughs> Missile Massacre, plus Beam Spam. Or Gauss Rifle. Firing. It's a barrier field. But it's Barrier Buster, and ignores size. Nice! Okay. Oh, you're doing the... the... Can I... Okay, I'm skipping that part, because that's a long animation. 
So you didn't touch me. Ah, okay, you haven't moved yet either. Okay. So, I don't have any... Do the beam sand, but then... Alright, so Team Battleship Volley now. They definitely sent the consciousness to that Gundam pilot earlier. Yes, he's sitting right next... Th they're right next to you. Wherever they are, they must be a new type. Barrier blocks all the damage. Okay. Next turn, we got him. Okay. Uh... Out of range of volley of fire. This is guys uh, this uses ammo and there's a much higher more damage and a higher crit chance. Let's go with that. And spirit commands. Let's dodge. Attack again. And not as already used to analyze on them. Is there anything I can do to up my crit crit chance? Okay, actually, I will use Excel, because that will take effect on my next turn. Miss. It's the barrier, but it crits. What I want. On my turn. Okay, let's move here then. Can't attack yet. Alright, so you... North size... One of you has a barrier breaker ability. Yeah, Black Getter Spike is a barrier buster ability. that up because I'm gonna get because this guy's probably gonna hit me and it's probably really going to hurt. Um Yeah that really hurt if I leveled up And you're in range for me to finish you off. And you cannot dodge this. Good night. Oh, I... Rocket Punch is still in the corner. I wonder what this death dialogue. Oops. A adapter and another barrier field. Okay. And... Yes, our point got... Enemy flagship has gone silent. But I bring back the mobile units and those two Gundams. Yes, sir. Zip. Shima, full speed ahead. Roger. Doodaloo. Grabbed their target. We're chasing the gas. I ran into a flare from the star, and now it's disappearing. I tried to absorb the star, but the star is devouring it. I see. This is what you were hoping for, wasn't it, Commander? I'm not letting you escape, Yamato. Full speed ahead. Now let the Yamato get past the flare wall. This will be the final battle between our ships. Manda, the enemy ship is heading straight for us. We should fight, keep fighting it longer. The, sea, the star will consume us all alike. Call for a ceasefire. Gambling ship is sent to reply. It says, and this would have a lot more impact if they translated the line the same earlier in the game. See earlier archive episodes on my YouTube channel above. It says, fools, or baka, or nuts. Let's see. Kodai. Fire the wave motion gun at the flare. What? Do as I say. Yes, sir. If 
Firing the wave motion gun at the flare. Fire! Sink the Yamato at all costs! Ignore it! Use the wave motion gun to clear our way out. There's an opening in the flare. Head straight through it. Maintain course. Yamato has passed through the prominence. Possible. The heat is much for our ship. The stern is melting. Steering control is lost. Ah! I'm sorry, Zaltora. I'm sorry, Hilda. Kaboom. Great Gamma's Empire, Supreme Leader's Office. Hmm. Supreme Lorder, this is all because of Schultz's incompetency. I had nothing to do with... Enough. Ah, uh, uh, Supreme Leader! Well, uh, well, well, everyone. Was that not a magnificent battle? It was quite an entertaining game. Yes? Yes, sir. The Fallen have been promoted to ranks, and their stat families given status as honorary gamblers. Zabelk! But it is impossible, to unthinkable, they're forced to be defeated by these... By these oversized dolls. No. Well, we the strength of an average cruiser teaming up with a battleship with remarkable artillery. It would be a mistake to make light of these tactics. School of small fry before the night of the Gamelin Navy. We will eat them for an afternoon snack. Hmm. I am pleased you all enjoyed the evening entertainment. That will be all for this evening. Oh, one more thing. Celestella. What was the name of that Terran ship again? It was the Yamato. The Yamato. I will remember that. Hmm. Something the matter, Minister Tala? The weapon that shot through the flare resembles something the Weapons Development Bureau is testing. Is that true? I cannot believe that barbarians and in, in this can't believe that any barbarians in this system could have the same level of technology as Gamelas. Terrans, a race that uses weapons modeled after their own image. I only sent my forces for a bit of entertainment, but could this be something more? Of course, it's not like I can do anything, even if I, even if I knew the answer. Note the planet that is visible in the window of Dessler's base. This may come up later. So you're saying we've come into a whole other world? It's the only explanation based on recent events. And I also cannot believe for the life of me that I've had to give this speech twice. That's impossible. I know. I've given... I know. What are the odds of me having to give the same you've traveled to another universe speech twice within a matter of days? That's just crazy. You'd think the, the boundaries between universes were falling apart. It's not too lot to believe it, I even though I'm even the one saying it, and even then, I'm still not wholly convinced. But it's not like you two are the first otherworldly travelers you've met. And it seems like your world is even completely different from mine. Hmm. The quantum jump equipment your units is fascinating. You see, the warp user we're using is kind of... borrowed. The fact that humanity can create technology to break through the light speed barriers is astounding, let alone the fact that it happened in an alternate world. It's not finished yet. The final system is supposed to take us where we want to go, not to other not to other universes that we can't safely be sure that we get back from in a reasonable manner. 
Super Space Sailing is already well established in our world, but the system that the 00 Quant is equipped with is totally different technology. So you teleported here in the middle of testing that tech. I'll just nod at this. We made another mis made a mistake during warp. We could end up being transported to another world too. I can't say any anything one way or another right now. But I can guess that if there were to be trouble in an alternate dimension and you didn't handle it well, there'd be no way out. I mean, you couldn't get back to your own world? Exactly. It's safe by safe to say that some small constellation that Setsuya and Setsuna and Teria ended up coming to our world. So we can't go home? That's something else I can't answer. See, the other two guy exiles from another dimension who are stuck here right now. If you can somehow replicate the conditions in which you ended up here, of all the possible worlds you could have gone to, Please, I'm begging you, you have to help us find a way back home. Of course, until we're able to figure out how to get home, we promise we'll do everything we can to help you out. You don't need to worry about staying here. You're more than welcome, especially since you've offered to help us. Also, leaving you adrift in the middle of deep space would be kind of a dick move. Unfortunately, you joined up with us in the middle of a huge war. First, we need to warp out of here to escape the gamblins chasing after us. After that, I hope you'll tell us all about the world you're from. Got it. Good to meet you. I'm one of those other, other. I'm one of those otherworldly travelers. Hmm. What's the matter, Kodai? Nothing. It's just I've I've never seen you smile before, Nagari. It's an alternate world. It's another world. It's too stupid to work for anyone to worry about their boring past here. I see. Ah, so you can smile. I feel that you were hard to get along too. I suppose I was touched by what you said, Tetsuna. Howdy worth, Commander. I'll introduce you to the aircraft squad. I, as you already know, we're all pretty dire straits here. Your help could have come at a better time. We'll do what we can. In the world, maybe this meeting could be called the Coming Discussion. Will we meet here, I wonder? Out. Established. Commencing experiment. Oh? Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, please like and subscribe. I also consider backing my Patreon. Patreon backers get episodes up to one week early of this show and any f future Let's Plays. Also, please consider backing my coffee. Uh, toss me a few bucks, also helps support the show, and it's not a monthly obligation or anything like that.